Gary Lineker has had his say on Manchester United star Marcus Rashford. England icon Gary Lineker has hit out at Gareth Southgate for his treatment of Marcus Rashford at the World Cup, after the star scored a stunning strike in Manchester United's Carabao Cup 2-0 win over Burnley. Rashford played 85 minutes as he got a second Red Devils goal, breezing past a couple of defenders before firing an effort past Bailey Peacock Farrell. Rashford made five appearances in Qatar under Southgate, but only started in one game, the 3-0 victory over Wales in the group stage. Despite only playing 137 minutes in the tournament, he managed to score three goals. The 24-year-old got a brace against Gareth Bale and co including an incredible free kick, and also came off the bench in the opening game against Iran to score in the 6-2 win. Leinker is one of the several pundits to think that Rashford deserved to play more. After impressive performances off the bench at the World Cup, Leinker took to Twitter after Rashford got United second on Wednesday. Must say, the only thing that was a tad bemusing with England was not sticking with that Marcus Rashford after his brilliance in the group stage, Leinker wrote. Christian Eriksen got the opening goal of the tie after some good work by Aaron Juan Basaka, but then Rashford doubled his side's lead before making way for Fred. There has been speculation regarding Rashford's future at Old Trafford, as Paris Saint-Germain have lurked in the hope to sign him on a free transfer. However United announced that they had activated the one-year option to extend his contract along with three of his teammates in Diogo Dalit, Luke Shaw and Fred. They all now have a year and a half left on their current deals. United icon and Sky Sports pundit Gary Neville also felt that Rashford was unfortunate not to feature more in Qatar. He looked like he carried his form pre-World Cup into the World Cup with England, he was unlucky not to play from the start in those knockout games, Neville said before kick-off. He definitely looked lively and that he's got his confidence back, a different player than what he was last year when there were large rumours that he should leave the club or he could be sold. Thankfully he's back and smiling again, which I think is really important for him. It looked to me at one point like he had the world on his shoulders.